Lopez, he's going to be chairing this, so take over. Thank you, Mayor Rico. Uh, welcome everybody <coughs> to today's Trinidad Housing Workshop. I know uh, we don't have everyone here in attendance because it is a work day still, but we do have the Trinidad Times TV 71 filming us live for our YouTube uh, visitors, if you will. Uh, basically, I'm just going to start off with the little welcome that I have been put together with the grace of staff, uh, some talking points. Uh, we developed in Trinidad a comprehensive plan that we adopted in 2017. Uh, one of the many things that was faceted out of this was a prioritizing our discussion of our housing needs here in Trinidad. Uh, part of that also resulted in our space to create situation, which was a catalyst for Trinidad to actively address our need for housing. Um, with that being said, we have been working in conjunction with the Department of Local Affairs and the Colorado Housing Financial or Financing Authority to uh, actively address this as well as um, get the city identifying the needs for developing additional and greater variety of housing projects here in Trinidad. Uh, as a result of this, we have also learned from several community members, including myself, uh, Greg Sund, our city manager, and Mallory Pillard, our director of our library, about the vision of housing section of DOLA, Department of Local Affairs, having $15.3 million in perpetuity allocated for uh, housing, especially for homeless and other low-income housing situations. Um, this has been a great asset to both Mr. Sund and I as we've taken other toolkits throughout the state last year <coughs> into the beginning of this spring with Ms. Pillard. Um, it's just another way that the Division of Housing, CHAFA, and other entities like now we have the uh, U.S. Department of Agriculture and HUD coming in on board in order to help us with our housing needs. Uh, the housing workshop is intended to spark a conversation on all types of housing needs in Trinidad. This includes anything from homelessness all the way up to a new market rate of housing development, which we are excited to be entertaining this notion. Uh, right now, uh, from my personal vantage point, we are fortunate to have this problem because it feels to me that it demonstrates that Trinidad is growing. Uh, we've had issues in the past where it has been stagnant or if not we've been depleting of uh, housing needs and therefore it became a renter's market, but now we find that it's turned the corner and we are having a more substantial need for housing due to our boom in not only population but our economy as well. Uh, with that being said, uh, I would like to everyone, if we can do an introduction, even those people here in the audience, if you could just briefly state your name and with which entity you are here from representing, or if you're just here on your own behalf for educational purposes. Uh, we will start here with Mr. Bill Simpson, if you would please. Uh, my name is Bill Simpson. I'm with the Colorado Division of Housing. I'm Jeffrey Burton. I'm with the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development. Jerry Lynn Martinez with CHAFA, Colorado Housing and Finance Authority. Eileen Herty, I'm also with HUD on the side of multifamily housing. I'm Phil Rico, Mayor of Trinidad. I'm Carlos Lopez, uh, City Council Member of Trinidad. My name is Tamara Pritchard, I'm with uh, the Department of Housing and Urban Development as well. Hi, I'm Scott Wilson, I'm the Program <coughs> Director for Single Family Housing for USDA Rural Development. Greg Sun, Trinidad City Manager. Uh, Victor Gutierrez, City of Trinidad. Clark, <coughs> Clark, Planning Administrator, City of Trinidad. I'm Carolyn Tranny, I'm with Luke Chapman as well as the new community relationship manager for the Southern Colorado region. I'm Margarita Martinez, I'm here on my own. Don't worry, I'm just going to see what I can get for revolving and fix my appointment area. Dwayne Harris, I'm uh, real estate agent for Town and Country Estates Realty here in Trinidad. And I'm Shane Rogan, also with Town & Country Estates Realty in Trinidad as Realtor. I'm Kelly Eckhoff, I'm property owner in downtown Trinidad. I'm Jim Kenton, uh, Southern Colorado Realty in Trinidad. I'm Stephen Kelly, I have my own company here in town, Colorado Mountain Spirit. And I'm also here representing the Spanish Peaks uh, Board of Realtors, which encompasses um, all of where from El Los Angeles County. I'm Elizabeth Kelly, the Sierra Learn. I'm Tom Murphy, Trinidad Times TV, live streaming. Yeah. We have a couple of people that just came in the back. Could you introduce yourself? Oh. 
Terry Campbell, owner broker of Colorado Homestead Properties in Aguilar. Kathy Scott, associate broker at Colorado Homestead Properties in Aguilar. Jane Cotero, Colorado Homestead Properties. Sure, yeah, go ahead, ma'am. Uh, 